Hello friends, very good evening. Welcome back to my YouTube channel, Talent Traders. Uh, myself Bala here and welcome you all to my channel. In the last video, we created a three candle sequence of fair value gap on our uh, charting scanner. And we made a video regarding the same. And uh, this session, uh, we will be trying to create uh, the fair value gap. So one more method. So here, uh, there is a difference between these two. So last video, we created this and uh, a red candle and a green and again a green candle so we find a fair value gap here and uh, this video will try to create this method so four candle sequence where exactly three consecutive bullish candle and previous one are red but we are calculating the fair value comparing to the previous i and uh, this current candle low and the fourth candle high so let me start to create here and uh, one more uh, uh, thing to tell you so good response for my videos and uh, thank you for supporting uh, our channel and if you are new to my channel kindly subscribe the channel to get more update and uh, this particular scanners which i have created uh, this uh, like uh, yesterday's video i just used the normal condition some of the scanners which i have created with customized indicators that i will only post it on my premium group so if you want to access all my premium uh, group scanners there is a uh, uh, kind of a camera cpr and uh, swing and btsc kind of scanners available on the group and for an intraday so intraday breakout scanners and candle patterns also there in the group okay so you can access all the scanners with copy and edit right so you may be uh, change the time frame for your need also you can copy and change it that is the premium group and it is a one-time charges if you wish you can just uh, get more details about uh, my whatsapp number shown on this video just ping me there and you'll be getting more detail so based on that uh, previous one so let me first uh, we will be marking that uh, how the candle is the first one should be a red one okay the first candle should be a red and after the three consecutive green candles so that is the logic where we are going to create so i will be marking this uh, sorry uh, this one would be uh, inside candle the second one uh, should be inside candle and third one would be a greater one and fourth one also be greater than and we have uh, finding a gap between this i and uh, this low so this is what a logic which we are going to create with this and uh, we have uh, one more inside bar also we are finding so it may be uh, not exactly like a previous scanner so we need to create the scanners in uh, uh, even more lines is required so first one so like a uh, closing candles so, so here what i used a uh, normal condition uh, which is available from uh, charting close greater than open so we are fetching a green candle and uh, we need a three green candle simply we are to use it uh, one candle ago and one candle ago simply one candle ago means it's a previous day two candle ago it means uh, previous to previous day that means third day and we need a one more thing fourth day but uh, that is we called as a third third day okay and it means must be less than uh, third days open so it's simply finding out first candle red and after next three candle green candle okay so let me find any stocks like uh, tata power into petro also there here so let me try to check tata power whether our condition is right or wrong so first candle is a red and second candle third candle fourth candle is a green so here also there is a fair value cap what we are expecting something like that exactly it is same so second candle is an inside and this is the gap Okay, so we try to find out such uh, things on this video, but we need to create even more conditions to get a right one. Okay, the first candle and uh, what we have seen here. Just a minute. Yeah, so this is what a condition which I want to find out. Okay, the first one and the second candle should be inside. So let me try to create that uh, second candle condition. Uh, that is a green candle that we know the high of that particular candle must be less than uh, high of uh, previous one okay so simply this candle is current candle and minus one minus two so simply minus two high uh, is less than the minus three high and the same which we can copy it and it should be greater than okay so low in this case the minus two low greater than minus three days ago low okay uh, that that exactly we find out this candle is a so if you are checking some other stock escorts and siemens uh, maybe it is doesn't have a fair value but he, here it is having a fair value but you can look at this uh, the second candle 
it's a keep on rising candle so the first one was a uh, like a spinning top but the second candle doesn't have a inside one okay so that is not adding but if you have added this uh, thing so you will be seen that stocks would be not there here this cuts initially is there now it is not there let me check uh, uh, x side or rec what we check this rec will it form such a problem? yeah so here the first candle is red and next three candle is green that's great but what happened here this is an inside candle but this is also green candle but as per our scanner just keep on rising this close greater than the high of minus one so that is also we needed to add it here so for example the current candle close that means the close of this candle current candle okay it must be greater than uh, high of previous one so high of one day ago like so let me copy this and one day ago close is greater than two days ago high that's it okay so if you added that so even uh, we have seen ace cards on the rec on the list if i have added this condition then rec will be removed from the list so you can't find out rec here so that's why uh, we have to create a scanner and gale and excite so let me go for a gale that perfectly uh, looks good but uh, we need to check uh, finding out uh, the gap between this and uh, this this particular uh, uh, red candle and this candle and uh, this looks like the same but uh, we don't find out the gap between this and this okay it is almost equal okay like like it is a three consecutive we find out and previous one would be a red candle and uh, we should try to add one more condition uh, there is a gap between that particular first candle and the second candle okay so how do we create let me try so let me compare the image the second one is green and third one is also be higher than okay yeah so we will add one more condition so the low of current candle okay the current candle it uh, it must be greater than uh, high of minus three candle so this will fetch you there is a gap between those stocks so almost to 12 stocks we filtered up to the previous con conditions and now we added so we have only four stocks so let me check those four stocks now gale will that exactly looking for uh, such a kind of pattern gale is there uh maybe that high uh to 219.45 this lows uh, 219.59 so there is a some gap um, but we need a much more gap so that is what a fair value gap right so let me check b b h e l and a b b a b b that's good exactly the pattern which you are looking at this candle high and this candle low so we have a gap and it is consecutively moving at the second one is an inside and what the right side image what we have taken out and it is exactly same as the pattern let me check even more a b b and the gain so a b b that is an a b b and tata power and um, b h e l that's a perfect one so second one is an inside and third one also greater than a green candle and fourth one also green candle we are finding an exact of our worldly gap from this kind of pattern and this is also happening at very lowest level so this is what a gap between this particular two stars okay so that we are finding out based on the scan which you have created now so let me check some more uh, stocks bhl abb gale tata power the power that is also looks exactly same there is a gap between this i and uh, this particular guy so what we are uh, seeing on that image is exactly the same pattern which you are finding out so this particular high of this particular candle and uh, same it's like a uh, spinning top and that high and this low having some gap okay so this is an inside candle that too that is also satisfying and keep on three consecutive candle and uh, gail already seen abb okay let me back test it any of the stocks uh, before that we have to save the scan and you follow the steps and you, you may be able to create such a scanner so previously on september 5th pvr and sinjin sinjin september 5 here i think uh, september 5 
दस बार वन टू थ्री दैट एग्जैक्टली वी आर फाइंडिंग द गैप हियर सो दिस वन टू थ्री द सेकेंड कैंडल इज साइड एंड दिस कैंडल हाई इज समेर अराउंड एट सेवेंटी सिक्स पॉइंट सिक्सटी फाइव दिस लोअर्स एट सेवेंटी सिक्स पॉइंट नाइनटी फाइव सो वेरी फ्यू नंबर ऑफ दैट इज अ वेरी मिनिमम नंबर ऑफ गैप बिटवीन दैट टू अवॉइड दैट वी कैन यूज वन मोर फिल्टर दैट बी यूज ए बी एस ए बी एस वैल्यू दैट शुड बी एग्जैक्टली थ्री डेज अगो दिस लो शुड बी डेली लो एंड इन सैड ऑफ दैट वी कैन आई जस्ट इट ग्रेटर देन क्लोज और हाई थ्री डेज अगो हाई इन टू नंबर वन पॉइंट जीरो वन दैट मीन्स इट इज मोर देन वन परसेंट सो वी डोंट फाइंड आई थिंक दैट इट इज एन इश्यू जीरो पॉइंट जीरो वन आर डेली क्लोज थिंक लो बेटर Yeah, that is showing some negative value. It is not working right now. So instead of that, we can try for a different method. This will works. Low greater than. Yeah, we are looking for a low greater than. Low and high. We are using a greater than the close. Okay, instead of this, instead of this, we can try this one. That will help you. But we need to find the gap. So we have to use an, any customized indicator. But I don't want to use any custom indicator. So you can manually check. If I am using custom custom indicator, it will be not working for you. MS MFSL twenty second day. Let me check manually. You can filter out MFSL twenty second eight. This should be the trade twenty second August. Where exactly the gap here and this high and this low. So that would be better one. So we are finding out the gap between this particular trade. Okay, so here twenty uh, second. It is keep on what exactly we are looking at the pattern, so that we are seeing here, and there is also be a gap, and it is keep on rising. So maybe we will try without this code, this particular thing. So but we will easily make it. But at this moment in the live recording, so I can't able to do it. But uh, if I am doing it in a customized way, so even we will comparing that two or three filters. Okay, so instead of that, we are removing this. And this will be working the scanner, okay. And uh, very minimum stocks only. And you need to manually filter out how many stocks. P E L sale twenty eight twenty August. Let me check that whether that works or not. Sale this one twenty eight August, and then there is a gap between here. So based on the pattern which you are finding out, maybe if it is happening at a lower level or a higher level, that is also very important that you can try. But this is the way where we can create such a kind of a scanner. What we are looking on the chart. Thank you so much. Thanks for watching, and if you are new to my channel, kindly subscribe the channel. Thank you so much uh, for supporting the channel. Thank you.